So brush your teeth and floss with me There's so much to learn and see So come along and smile with me It's the Kimmy Tutor Show That's me! Hi, it's Kimmy the Tooth Tutor and I'm here today with my friend Elvis Hello. and also with Robin. Hi! And I'm also a tooth tutor mm -hmm. and we're here to talk about hidden sugars and the foods we love. Mm -hmm. So I think over on Kimmy's side, she has the healthier of the snacks. And over here, I have some of the snacks that we probably would choose to have, but maybe have some sugar that we didn't really <laughs> know about. Yeah, so um, let me see. So I, we made this chart, and each baggie has how much sugar is contained in one serving of that food or drink. So I don't know if you can see it, but this is all the sugar that's in the serving of cheese. And this is all the sugar that's in a serving, one serving of a Pepsi. Yeah, it's kind of insane. And this is a serving of cheese, all of those pizzas. So I would definitely say that is one of the best snacks that we could choose. Probably the best one we have here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, in addition to that, we have a vanilla or plain yogurt. And how much is in this one? Um, it's three quarters of a cup as a serving, which is a pretty good amount, mm -hmm. especially for a child. And, and it only really has like a teaspoon of sugar. Right, very little sugar. And you can add <clears throat> fresh fruit, mm -hmm. unsweetened, put some ras raspberries in it or some blueberries or applesauce, and it tastes just as good as the sweetened yogurt. Yeah. And then we have um, this yogurt, which is up Six there years. in that corner. And this has more sugar in it because it's vanilla flavored. Two and a quarter teaspoons. <clears throat> so you wouldn't really think to put that much sugar in something you were gonna eat, but it's hidden no, in there. It is. And then we, this is no sugar added peaches, and the no sugar added peaches have, um, sorry. This only has, well, this has had one two thirds teaspoon. Yes, so it's not very much. And this is all a serving is. There's like three pieces of peaches. Yeah. <clears throat> um, for the crackers, the crackers, this is a serving size. It's only six crackers. I've never eaten that few crackers in a sitting. <laughs> Nor I. <laughs> but um, there's two and a half teaspoons or two and two thirds teaspoons of sugar in that. We think of crackers, I think of being healthier than chips. Yes. Well, because we don't think there's sugar. But carbs turn to sugar and yep. they stick in our teeth. So from a tooth standpoint, not a good snack. Yep. So um, I have some chips over here. Mm -hmm. Who doesn't like a good chip? That's my go-to snack. This is a serving size of chips. My little granddaughter, who's not even two, could devour this small serving in no time. And again, it sticks in our teeth. Um, then over here, I have some yogurt that is flavored. This is strawberry vanilla. It's 200 calories, which is so it's more than double than some of the other better ones we were speaking yeah. of. Yeah, this is this one was 100 calories. And this one has <laughs> all the sugar just in this tiny little container. It does have protein. Yeah. I mean, there are worse snacks, but we just want you to see how much sugar is in there. Realize that. And then, what child wouldn't love this? Bring right. M&Ms on top. This has 25 grams of sugar. For every four grams, it's one teaspoon, right? Mm -hmm. So if there's 25, that's six teaspoons of sugar in this small container. Yeah, that's insane. Yes. Um, and then I have a serving of ice cream over here. And what does that have for sugar, Kimmy? Do you know? Um, Yes, it has four and a half teaspoons. Look at that. The sugar takes up almost as much space <laughs> as the ice cream. <laughs> that is kind of but it's good. I mean, it tastes good. We like it. Yeah. We're not saying that we don't like these things, but they're just maybe you need to be thoughtful about how often you have them. Right. And then I over here have some peaches in the heavy syrup, which I believe it or not, I had a hard time finding. Which is amazing. Which is good, I guess. But this has 19 grams of sugar, so five teaspoons of sugar. It's, yeah, it's a little over five teaspoons. In these tiny sugar. little, yeah, and there's only, only two pieces of peach in there. Yep, yep. And then over here, this really brings it home to me. Yeah. I don't know about you, Kimmy, but a Pepsi, 
you know, I work in a dental office and people tell me all the time they drink two Pepsis a day. Someone told me the other day they drink 12 iced teas a day. Mm -hmm. This Pepsi has 210 calories and it has almost 14 teaspoons of sugar in this small amount mm -hmm. of soda. That is outrageous. Even Gatorade, you know, people yeah. think it's good for hydration and electrolytes, but again, it's right next. Oh yeah, I've got the one instead of the red one. This is a serving, so it's a it's a big amount for a small mm -hmm. child, but still it has all the sugar. Mm -hmm. And if you read, the other thing to be mindful of, and I, I want to mention is most all of these drinks, the first ingredient is water, and the second ingredient is citric acid, mm -hmm. which is so bad for the yeah. enamel in our teeth. Yes, and there's is. juice. There's juice. We all like juice. Um, this one looks like probably one of the better juices you could buy. It's 100% juice, peach, mango. We know V8's always full of vegetables. Yeah, it's like super healthy. But it has 23 grams of sugar in one cup. That's yeah. six teaspoons of sugar. And what we were talking about earlier was that 25 grams of sugar should be the maximum amount of sugar a child should have. For a day. For a day. Not for a cup of juice. Right. Or, or a some peaches or yogurt right they have this they would be out for the day for this they're done for the day right one um it used to be not too long ago they were suggesting kids up to age three have maybe three ounces of juice a day now they the american association of pediatrics says a child under one should have zero sugar i mean zero juice no juice at all and then um, I printed out this little paper and it says at the most four ounces of healthy juice for children age one to three. That's very small amount. It is very small. Just be mindful of what your kids are snacking on and eating for dinner. 25 grams of sugar a day is not very much. Um, when the kids are going to have a snack, maybe give them a choice of three things. Kids like to be in control of their own destiny. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe say, would you like some yogurt with some fruit, or would you rather have some crackers, or I could peel you an apple. You know, let them choose. Kind of like having several toothbrushes on hand, and they can choose which one they want to use, mm -hmm. not whether or not they're going to brush, which toothbrush they're going to use. And from my personal experience, working in a clinic all day, I think the one um, common denominator when I see a child with a lot of cavities, it's something sweet that they're drinking. Oh, Whether it be juice or Gatorade, it's usually something daily. Yeah. Um, you know, keep those sippy cups just with water. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so, um, if if a child is only introduced to water in a cup mm -hmm. instead of their formula or right. breast milk or whatever, then they're going to be fine with it. Right. That's right. They don't need juice. No, juice no. isn't really going to help their body or their mouth. No, they don't need it. Um, so, <laughs> Elvis and I would like to say thank you to Robin for joining thank us. Thank you for having me. <laughs> <laughs> and um, we hope this is helpful to you. And if you have any questions, I think you would like to reach out to both of us. Yeah. <laughs> Take care. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.